Welcome to the Nicholas 11x12 technology. Today I'd like to show you how to install, update, upgrade or however you may want to call it to Android 5.0 on your Android device. I'll be upgrading my Sony Xperia Z2 to 5.0 since Sony started to roll out the update not too long ago. I'll be showing you a demo with this Xperia Z2, but your Android device should be similar. Also note, not all devices actually have the Android 5.0 update to offer. Besides, you may need to factory reset your phone after the Android 5.0 update to fix some bugs, glitches or performance issues. First you may get a notification on an available update for your phone. But if you don't get one, go to settings, then to about phone, and there you can check for updates manually if you want. As you can see, this Xperia Z2 is currently running Android 4.4.4. To start the update, go to Software Update. Then select the available system update and hit Download. This will now take a while. Make sure you're on Wi-Fi to avoid surprisingly high bills. Once the download is complete, the system will verify the downloaded files. After a while, you'll get to see this pop-up, Select Details. Now you can hit install, but make sure you have plenty of battery charge left, otherwise you could break your device if the power goes out while updating. Then hit install. Wait a bit and eventually the phone will power itself off. And will restart to start the updating process. Now this will take some time, but once that part is done, the phone will restart once again and will give you a long long booting screen. At some point you'll finally get to see the Android is upgrading screen. At this stage the apps are being optimized. This will also take some time to complete, but eventually it'll say finishing boot and pretty much boots into your updated operating system. In my case an NFC update was applied too. And yeah, just so you know, once the upgrade is complete, the phone can be a bit buggy and slow at times. As you can see the UI looks a bit different already. The menu now has a much cleaner look to it. As you can see we've successfully installed Android 5.0, 5.0.2 in this case on this phone. Android 5.0, the lollipop update, that's how you install it. Right after the update I noticed my phone got a lot slower. Basically I noticed performance issues, higher battery consumption and apps, even simple ones such as Sony's music app named Walkman didn't work properly anymore. Basically the phone didn't work properly altogether anymore after I've applied the Android 5.0 update. But just like pretty much with all operating systems, an upgrade will most of the time always lead to such issues and that's why I always recommend a clean, fresh install or in this case just reset the phone and you'll get the clean, fresh and untouched Android 5.0 OS. Basically you'll have to start over, so back up your data first before doing that and only then you'll get to see Android 5.0's real face, not the beaten up one. And that's pretty much it, I hope this video could help you out on how to install this update. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas11x12techx.com to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.